So I got done with my uh, my Jeep review. Um, you know, one of those sweet things. It's completely free because I have the extended warranty protection plan. Um, so, you know, change the oil, rotate the tires, do the 59-point check. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with the Jeep type thing. Um, this is one of those spots that's on my way home that I have not stopped and looked at before. Um, you know, just because. Um, now, the sign up on the road says the trail is closed. So there's a trail that supposedly walks down the, uh, walks down somewhere through there, you know. Um, yeah, it's closed. I can't even find access to it. That's okay. Um, the trail here is still, or right here, is still open. So it's a, this is a War Eagle, or a spot on the War Eagle. I don't know if it's river or creek or stream. Don't know for sure. I just know it's War Eagle. And... It's a pretty view. You can see off over that way. That's the, the highway road that crosses it. So there's, um, I can see, man, there's some little minnows. Yeah, they're not going to show up. That might be one. Little minnow, kind of dead center of the screen. And then I lose them. Huh. Anyway, little minnows in the water. It's a pretty spot. You know? Well, y'all have an awesome day, and I will talk to you later. So in a, a couple of weeks, um, I'm supposed to go camping with some friends. Um, and the, the, the awesome thing about that is I've never been here. <laughs> never been camping here, no idea. So I, uh, I reserved a site sight unseen, and this is the site that I've got reserved. You know, now again, I'm, I'm here today and I'm just kind of filming, but uh, uh, when I come here in a couple of weeks, this will be the site. Um, it's an RV site, I won't lie, with a tent extra. Um, so that's the tent pad, and there's you know, a burn pit and a grill and, you know, the table, and I'm going to turn the other way, you don't want to see the Veek, the Jeep or the back of the Jeep. Uh, but because it's an RV set, it's got power and water. You know. Um, it's one o'clock. And there's some shade right here, which is awesome. Um, I'm going to need to figure out how to put a tarp above the table so it's always got some shade. You know. Because, uh, yeah. Might be a little warm in June. Won't give you the dates, I'm sorry. You know, don't need anybody to know when they can, uh, when they can rob me, because I won't be home. But, uh, I think I got a good sight, you know, just kind of off the top of my head. It's more than large enough for the tent, you know. Say, so kind of back up in there, I don't know if you can see it, the, uh, there's a picnic bench kind of up there. Um, anyway, the, uh, the tent only sites are all hiking. You gotta kind of go over there, I don't know if you can see the little building. Uh, there's a little building over there. It's a restroom, which is, is good. I, you know, I like to be relatively close, but not on top of the restroom. So there's a restroom there, but you had to park there and then hike into all the tent sites. Um, and I wasn't trying to, how do I say this? I wasn't trying to carry a tent and then a, a, a cover and then the ice chest and the dog and the sleeping bag. And yeah, you, you know, I love me 55 old. I don't like to call myself lazy, but I'm going to tell you I'm lazy. I would much rather park right here. You know, where I'm standing and set my tent up right there. And having said that, I have a friend who's got a, a like a van camper, for lack of better words. And so they're, um, they're actually going to share the site with me. 
Um, cause that way they can park it on the driveway like it would be an RV and we're going to split the cost. So it works out great, you know, but anyway, I think it's kind of cool. I think it's a good site. Like I said, it's one o'clock. And so you can see there's, there's, you know, high noon sun happening. That won't be an issue, but I'll put a cover or something up over here. Um, that way Panda, if she's hot, she can lay on the cool concrete and not be in the sun. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be awesome. Um, and I know, because there's, there's a bunch of us, I think there's six or eight families or something like that that are camping. I know a few of us. Um, it's either that slot right there or that slot right there. I'm not sure which, but it's one of those two. We've got two more sets of, of people, you know, friends that we know that are camping. So it's like there's four of us right here. You know, and whether we're burning at their burn pit or we're over here burning at our burn pit. Um, yeah, it's going to be a good little camping thing. I'm looking forward to it. You know? So, with that being said, y'all have an awesome day and you'll see this again. <laughs> and I'll talk at you later. Well, since I lost most of my day with the uh, Jeep doctor appointment, um, and it is supposed to rain the majority of next week, my thought process is, is I need to go ahead and mow. Um, it's tall enough that I can mow. It's not tall enough to be bothersome yet. But if I have to wait a week because it rains every day next week, it will be too tall again. And I don't like it when it's too tall. Um, so again, since I lost most of the day, instead of dealing with soil, I'm just going to go ahead and mow and, um, you know, that way I don't have to worry about mowing next week. And if I get a, you know, a dry spell for an hour or two, because the storm goes around me, then I can, um, you know, I can work on potting soil then. Um, I will say this morning, and I haven't seen it yet, my little old, uh, now, let's see if I can find him now in the trees. Oh, oh, he just flew off. Sorry, I don't know if you saw the little black spot fly. Um, but he let a little girl drink this morning. And then he kind of dipped and swiped her and all the way down until she landed on the big rock there. And then he did this little U-shaped flippy thing and was clicking and chirping and clicking and chirping. And he finally landed and she came back up and got another drink. So I think he's got himself a girlfriend. Um... If I can catch it on film at some point in time, I will. If not, sorry. Um, yeah, it's just kind of cool. All right, let me get to mowing, and I'll talk to you later.